Live at the shop, live at the shop, another day, another day. Custom Honda scooter. That custom seat I did. The Helix. Laser engraved in the back. Rugged. Yeah, we do it all at the shop, man. Everything, everything, everything. Custom paint. But let's get back. Let's get back to what's going on today. All right, we got this 87 Monte Carlo SS. T-tops. Took this top out of here because these doors be locking. Uh, you see, getting that deluxe touch. It's out of Tennessee. See it? So, uh, first thing I noticed was the rust. I don't know if you're going to have problems with that soon. But uh, I don't got to deal with that. I guess the body shop would deal with that. I already started taking it apart, but this is for you G bodies lovers. I'm gonna show you step by step on what it takes to turn one of these into a showpiece. You can see that uh, that dashboard is kind of kind of bad. So I'm gonna take this. Bench seat out, buckets, uh, digital dash going in, floor shifter, custom door panels. Uh, I think that's about it. I think with this one, I'm gonna do uh, some kind of lights. He's going, uh, I think that voodoo purple. So it's gonna be like a, he want the orangish basketball color. It's going in, so that's one project, and it runs good too. Oh, let me see if I can start it up. Yeah, so we got a good running car. That's what you need to start with. All you people out there, start with a good running car first instead of some bullshit. All right, on to the next. So we just got this 75 Impala dropped off. It has a chameleon mauve flip. I don't know if it's showing up, because I can't really tell on the camera. But it has a funny color flip on it. It's flipping. I see it. So just got this dropped off. Got the chrome rack. And he took the scissor top off. And got the regular fold back top. Got a dip chrome. Still needs the brams put in, the pumps. But it seems like it used to be a hydraulic car because it has the two holes right there. And I think that's from where the, the regular hydraulic rams used to be at coming through the back. I'm not sure. Don't hold me to it. But uh, as you see, this is how the car comes to me. So I will be documenting the whole build of this 75 Impala build. Somebody put the uh, soundproofing heat shield on the floor and the walls, side panels, walls, whatever. Somebody did half that for me. I'm just going to vacuum it out, clean it up. Throw my carpet pad on top of that. And there you go. But got the digital dash in there. So basically, paint the bottom of this dashboard. And 
paint the column. One with a raspberry in color interior, that's what he said, some type of raspberry. Maybe with some gold color stitching or something, I don't know. I usually go on the fly, I don't know what I'm going to do. But, you can see. Seventy five Impala. So you're going to see the whole build of this one, too. I will document every step of my design process. So stay tuned for this one, too. Until the next time, I holler.